Assalamu alaikum all viewers and listeners I hope you will find and feel fresh Today I am going to cover the remaining portion of the sketch and in today's lecture I am going to show you the construction mode and we will see something inside the constraint especially we will focus on tangent and symmetric the others you can see by yourself easier and and last we will focus on the dimension that's really easy for you people so first of all what does construction mood mean that whenever you are draw something so that's not for the purpose to extrude or something but the purpose of construction mode is to construct something on that like for example I draw a circle uh, a rectangle and I'm selecting it and I select the construction geometry so you right now you can't extrude this rectangle right now because this is for the construction purpose right now you can draw some other circles right sorry okay so it's mean the purpose of the rectangle is not to extrude it itself but the purpose is just to make something above on it right now again select this circle select this circle and what to do actually is again okay so this is something about the construction mood how can you do this just draw something and select the profile and just check the construction mood again if you want to turn off the construction mood so again select the profile and uncheck the construction mood so how you understand how can you use the construction mode right now and constraint let me show how can you use the tangent for that I need a circle after that I draw a random line but right now what I should to do is actually I want to make this line tangent to this surface for that what I should do I will select tangent I will select first this line and then the circle so right now this line is tangent to this surface I think you can okay so this is how you can use the tangent or even let me check by selecting both the line and circle then such kind of mirror will pop up and you just check on the tangent mood okay what is symmetric means actually let me show for example when I draw a line dimensioned it for example this is 14 right now let me keep it this one 20 and I want to insert a center line right now but I want to make this line symmetric with this reference center line so for that I will go to symmetric and I have three points right now just press and hold control key click on this point then click on this center line and then click on this point 
Okay. So now this line is symmetric about this center line. It's mean the line is same on the left as it is on the right side. And the rest of the portion is related with the dimension. So that's really easy whatever you want to draw. Okay. So once you click on the dimensions, so this is really easy because automatically the uh, dimension portion pop-ups on the generated profile. So for that, this is for right now. Let me give it six, and just by double click on the dimension and keep it eight right now. Okay. So this is how you can do the dimension either, and from here you can choose to refit. Okay. So how you like this video? you have any trouble in the sketch portion just write in the comment bo uh, box so I will answer that so thanks for watching